welcome back to the Stephen F. Austin Lumberjacks Dynasty. We are in episode two. We are about to play FCS Midwest. They are 0-9, and uh, we're just going to jump into this game. I already covered the recruiting and all that, so we're going to jump into this. So we we can't do our typical scouting report like we usually do because, uh, well, you can't look at their roster, but... Uh, we have the talent advantage. We have a 68 overall team compared to their 63. We have a, an advantage on offense and defense. But I'm expecting this to be a close game, tough game, because that's how these sliders work, I'm sure. So uh, we're running Rice again, 4-2-5. Our visiting prospects are Aaron Walker, uh, 89, the number 89 free safety in the country, Brandon Darby, the 164th halfback in the country and Barry Ball <laughs> uh, number 50 and uh, the, the number 50 fullback in the country um, rushing for 100 yards with our running backs isn't too plausible though so we'll see how that goes so we're wearing, wearing the red influence on our uh, uniforms this week well it's an interesting look purple and red together interesting uh, color combination the the red represents the blood of our opponents after we chop into them well that's that's vicious <coughs> okay so we are gonna take the ball let's go let's get after these guys it looks like yeah they're running a zone so I'm gonna move mostly back over here let's look at that out route for Crawford Got him. Ah, oh, come on. Cut up field, Crawford. That was a good throw. It's going to be third and two, though. Let's see. Third and two. They're collapsing the interior of the line, so we're going to hopefully get to the outside, and we'll get a big run out of this. <laughs> wow. We lost yardage, and we had everyone blocked, but our... Uh, our running back is just so slow. We're at the 45. I think I'm going to go for it. Hopefully we can get it. Uh, all right. Let's see. I forgot to put conservative catch on, so that's not good. And he drops it. Turnover on downs. Ah, <sighs> uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Man. So their quarterback is a scrambling quarterback. You gotta keep the spy on him. Damn. So it's going to be uh, second and six. So th for this one, they have five wide receivers out there. I got to run my uh, dime situation. They have a bunch on the left. Yep, I knew they were going to try and run. Nice. We get them in the backfield for a sack. And, and he's injured. Hopefully he's done for the game. That would be good for us. You're a jerk. I know. Pretty similar to the last game against FCS. So we, we need to get our running game going for sure. Dude, Attaway. Wow. <laughs> that wasn't a good decision. Or a good throw. I forced it. Run a spy again. And they ran a screen, and we get them in the backfield. We hold them to another field goal try. And, yep, right down the middle. So it's a 6 nothing lead. We're down to FCS Midwest. I knew one of these FCS schools was going to give us trouble. Um, what we really need to do is get our running game going, but our running back is so slow. I'm thinking I need to bench Barnes because he's just so slow. And a nice little return for Johnson. Nice. Gus Johnson, that's our backup running back right there. All right. 
So let's 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 try and get this running game going. Oh my God, Barnes, you're so slow. Ugh. I'm getting that spark uh, in the last game either. So let's try Gus Johnson. Wow. <laughs> what in the fuck was that? This is embarrassing, Attaway. Good grief, man. Let's try this cover three cloud. And obviously we're going to run our... We're going to run our uh, spy again because... Oh, they're running an, a triple option. Interesting. Come on, get them on. Damn it. That was a good play call by them. Got him, sack. Oh, I'm not a well, fake person. Get it, but hell yeah. We might actually be getting a stop. Of course, I might jinx it. So we're at the end of the first quarter. They're up six to nothing on us. Uh, whatever the Warthogs or Tuskers or whatever the hell this team is called. Um, we're down six to nothing. And our offense is playing like booty cheeks right now. So we have five wide receivers out here. Come on. Get him. Oh, good job, Caleb. Nice, nice reaction. Whew, I thought he was going to get that in there. So we finally get a defensive stop. Um, we really need to get our offense going. We need to hit a big play. Maybe we need to get plaster in there and get some read option going. Nice. Good job, Mosley. Good throw, plaster. There's a big play. Finally. Nice. Okay. Big run for a running back, finally. They're running a man. No, they're running a zone. Hmm. They're playing off coverage, so. Oh, oh my goodness. Bruh. And Attaway still has not completed a pass. I need to go for it. I mean, this is just insane. Dude, what are you doing? Throw! Oh my goodness! <sighs> Foster was open right away. I tried to get it to him, and Attaway throws it. I'm, I, I'm speechless. So they have four wide receivers on the right side. That makes me nervous. Oh, good play, Ryan Epperson. That's our linebacker right there, our middle linebacker. Okay, so we hold him to another field goal try. And he drills that one, and they're up two scores now. Híjole. Boyd in motion. Hopefully we get something here. Yeah, so Gus Johnson has a lot more explosiveness than uh, Jeremy Barnes does. So I think Gus Johnson might be taking this spot. Oh, good block. We got Gus Johnson for the first down. Okay, we, we're getting some momentum now. Let's keep it going. Let's keep this going. Well, that was a waste of play. At least uh, we get a f our first completion. Of the game. Oh, Third and three at the uh, 30, what, 33 yard line. Got him. Got Roberson. Nice. Okay, let's go in no huddle because we need to score. We need to, we need to score a touchdown. Nice catch, Crawford. Okay, I'm going to call timeout there. And Crawford's hurt. Son of a biscuit. I get someone that'll win. Nice touchdown. Good job, Mosley. There you go. Finally, we're on the board. We don't get shut out <laughs> by FCS Midwest. Oh. Ooh, 69 yard drive nice uh, it was very important that we uh, we get that score because not only do they get the ball right now they get the ball to start the second half so we needed to score on that drive bad yeah they're running the Hail Mary ooh ugly throw intercept that nice Barlow okay well at least we get an interception that's XP um, if we had visiting prospects, that's good for us. So Barlow gets the interception. We end the half. It's 9-7. to seven. FCS Midwest is up. Um, 
We did get some momentum on that last offensive drive, so hopefully we can keep that going. Hopefully our defense can get some momentum off of this this interception right here, even though it was a forced, horrible throw. So we have more plays, more yardage, more first downs, and we are down because of turnovers, um, stupid decisions by me. However, we're still in it, so we'll keep it going. Our cover two. Put Robinson in the uh, spy. So it's third and eight. Uh, four wide receiver set. They snap that. Oh my goodness. Come on, guys. You got to be able to cover that. I freaking hate third downs. FCS Midwest is making us look like little bitches right now. Second and ten. Looks like they're in the wishbone. Oh, bitch. Get out the way. Oh Get out the way, bitch. <laughs> Oh, that guy just got steamrolled. Wow. Who was that? Honestly, you get benched for that. Nelson. Caleb Nelson, really? Come on, bro. Oh, wow. He got absolutely steamrolled by the freaking quarterback. These sliders are no joke. They, uh... Wow. All right, so we hopefully have man defense. No, they're running a zone. Yeah, I, I don't like how our... Nice, got Foster down the seam. Beautiful, good job, Foster. So let's see what they're running. They're, ooh, they're running an isolation. And it looks like they're blitzing, so I need to make sure that I make the right read. Got Crawford. Nice. There you go. Hmm. Nice touchdown, Roberson. Right across the middle. Let's go. Woo! <laughs> Let's go. Nice. There we go. We get a stop. Good job, 48. Who is that? I forget. Yeah, I don't know his name yet. Darren Robinson. Okay. Damn. Darren Robinson's been tearing it up today. We'll make that our first read. Crawford. Nope. Wow. Come on. Damn, I screwed that up. I don't know why I forced it there. Nice, Valier, good job. Hell yeah, we, we we make a play on defense finally. So we're here at the end of the third quarter. FCS Midwest uh, still has a lead on us. This has been an ugly game for our offense. Uh, we have a lot to work on, but uh, it's been a good game for sure. We really need to make a big play on this, this drive. Um, of course, it's going to be difficult. All right, let's see if uh, let's see if we can make a play here. Wow, on their tight end, and he is. But let's see if we can make a play. Oh my goodness, he almost completed that. Wow. Well, we got lucky. He dropped it. I mean, so far we're undefeated on uh, when we run it with a fullback in terms of the uh, fullback dive. So let's try this again. Okay, Lawson gets it. We got a first. So they're running a zone. What? Nice. Plaster up the middle. 16-yard gain. Let's go. He's made necessarily bad passes. It's just I make bad decisions. Okay, let's try Mosley on the jet sweep. Nice run, Mosley. Nice. Okay. Let's go. Yeah, let's try the jet sweep again. It's Crawford running it this time. What? 
Nice. Good spin move. Go, Crawford. Let's go down to the six-yard line. Woo! Let's go. Good job, Crawford. So I'm going to waste as much of the clock as I can. They look like they're bringing the blitz, honestly. I might. Yeah. Nope, they get my get the stop. Damn, I gotta kick the field goal. So I have to kick the field goal here. We'll take the lead as long as I don't miss. Got it right down the middle. We take the lead. Our defense needs to make a play here. Whoop, trying to make me jump. They're wasting a lot of time. <laughs> wow, okay. We'll take it. <laughs> okay. Yeah, they're wasting a lot of time. I don't I don't know what's going on here. It's a glitch, I'm guessing. I'll take it. Perfect timing. That's what she said. Nice, and we get the tackle. <laughs> they call timeout. So they basically have one one play left, and I think I'm pretty sure I know where they're going with it. So we're gonna run three man deep. Last time this quarterback tried to make a deep throw, it was wildly inaccurate. So hopefully it's just as inaccurate. And we get the stop. Oh, they have one more play left. So we're going to do the same thing. Let's get Epperson down the field. Not sure why they're in the triple option. Okay, that's interesting. And we get, get him on the ground. That's weird. So we win the football game. Um, computer AI is completely retarded, but we'll take it. We get our second W. <laughs> we get the, our second W of the season. Um, it was not a good showing. That's it's not a good look because we're about to get into real football play. We're playing UL Monroe next week and then Michigan the week after. Uh, with how we performed in this game, it's not looking too pretty. Um, we just need to we need to improve our. Uh, consistency on offense and obviously uh our running back was a uh, gus johnson was a huge improvement over jeremy barnes who's in intensely slow we, we need to improve in that our defense is what it is i mean it's a 425 it's not built to stop the run and these guys were a power running team for the most part so plaster was two of three for 37 yards, um, Attaway was not good. Of course, you could blame the user on that one, on those two interceptions. Those were my fault. There was a couple drops, I believe, too. Um, it was not a good passing passing day for us. Uh, Gus Johnson came in and gave us a little bit of a spark in terms of running the ball, whereas Jeremy Barnes, we, he could barely even get a yard. Um, we really need to uh, improve our running game. I don't know how that's going to happen without new players coming in. Receiving into things, obviously we didn't pass the ball well, so our leading receiver was Anthony Foster, with uh, well, at least in receptions. Uh, Crawford led us in total receiving yards. He had one drop, and our touchdowns came from Mosley and Roberson. Blocking-wise, no, no, no sacks allowed, um, which is a surprise. Ryan Chambers and... Tyler Boyd with the uh, pancakes for us. Ryan Epperson and Darren Robinson, who was our defensive player of the game for sure, um, they led us in tackles, tackles for loss. Darren Robinson blew everyone away with five, and then he had two sacks as well. He had a breakout game today. Interceptions, we had Barlow and Valier um, with the interceptions. Defensively, deflections I should say Epperson and Nelson who got run over by the quarterback <laughs> uh, with the uh, the deflections and then Epperson with a forced fumble good so our star players you know pulled it out and we ended up winning because of Darren Robinson and Epperson uh, and plays by Crawford and Roberson and Mosley and Foster Gus Johnson coming in and Taking over for Jeremy Barnes, giving us a little bit of momentum running the ball. That's what we needed. So we're 2-0. and I, We definitely needed that victory, even though it wasn't a blowout like I'm 
I was hoping we would get. And I forgot to look at who won time of possession and all that, but uh, no one won, won the turnover battle. It was zero. But we did win time of possession. We had more rushing yards, more passing yards, and more first downs. So um, our turnovers neutralized each other. So our next uh, opponent is UL Monroe. I will see you guys in that next episode. I appreciate you guys watching. Peace.